Hi everyone, my name is Liz and welcome, welcome back to my channel. So in this video I am going to talk and show you as the title is saying about how to clean your makeup brushes because yeah well and I'm gonna do that in my kitchen so I have my oil stove here behind me an old arger or wood arger who have been reconstructed some I don't know 40 years ago or something like that into uh, an oil burner so anyway why do we want to clean our makeup brushes well we want to clean them because that um, yeah we get a little visitor here Odin your fellow host so yeah he just wants some attention so that's great he can, he can stay here so um, we want to clean our makeup brushes because that well on our face we have a lot of bacteria all over our body we have a lot of bacteria who should be there because that shows that we have a healthy body and a healthy skin and so forth if we don't have bacteria on our skin <clears throat> then our skin can't resist all the things that it had been put through in general so healthy skin have bacteria but we also put a lot of products on it like uh, skin tonic and serums and cleansers and you know water and soap and an awful lot of makeup and stuff like that so this also all these things is also sitting in our skin no matter how much you cleanse it you can't really cleanse it off and like I said you shouldn't really be doing that either but on our makeup brushes who will awfully have of course will have this transferred to them as we're using them in our face they also get dipped in different products and some of these products is going to be left on those brushes so if you wear dark makeup one day and then wear light makeup the next day it will be transferring over so the colors won't look the way you wanted them to or whatever something products are sitting on bacteria is sitting on and um, you therefore have to clean your brushes so how often should we clean our brushes uh, I have read that one set every day I think that's a little excessive um, another one said whenever you think is due but that's kind of very subjective sort of is when do you think is due that's kind of not really a, a lot of great guidelines so uh, we're just having a coffee while we start this video yeah so I clean my brushes at least once a week and that's because I don't want the product to be transferred I don't want a lot of bacteria to be on them and I just think that's more hygienic that way but you do you how do we clean our brushes well there are a lot of ways obviously you can just take them out under the water and then clean them up but I don't think they become really clean of that part then you can use hand soap to clean them with but I find that um, it's extremely difficult to get all the soap out of them then you can buy a lot of expensive products to clean your brushes with and that I think is a little bit of waste of time why? because you can make your own brush cleanser thing at home with things that are much cheaper, last you lots, lo lots longer, and uh, yeah, that's just how I prefer it. And it does clean the brushes indeed. So what I'm gonna do today is show you how I clean my brushes. So uh, I won't show about uh, spatulas because spatulas is a completely different thing. The, um, they should be soaked in water and washed with soap and take forever to get them out. So to be quite fair honest to you, I very often buy so cheap spatulas that I can just throw them out instead of cleaning them. So I won't be showing you the spatulas, but I will be showing you the brushes. So let's move to my kitchen table here behind me and uh, then I'll show you how I clean my brushes. Woo. So lighting difference here let's just let the camera absorb that for a time so what do we need to to clean our clean our brushes 
We need a container to put them in. We need some dishwasher thing. And we need some general vinegar. Uh, the general distilled one, not anything about like, uh, you know, the one that you get with the uh, white, red wine vinegar, white wine vinegar. No, 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 just the general distilled one. Then you need some, uh, some water, a spoon, a eating soup spoon, dining spoon thing here, and then the brushes that you need to clean. So what do you need to do? You take your spoon and then you pull out one spoon of uh, dishwasher and put it down your jar. And then you take your vinegar and you need two, two tablespoons of vinegar. So one tablespoon of the dishwasher, two tablespoons of the vinegar. And then you put some water in the jar so it's kind of half full for me. Depend of course for what jar you have, but I put this much in. And then you put your brushes down. Remember to do it with uh, the brush heads down and the scarf up so that it doesn't run any uh, water into the brush. Because if it does that, then your brush is, uh, if water comes in here, your brush will start, uh, it will start dissolving the lime, whatever it's called, in here that's holding the brushes together. So, um, so just uh, put them down like this so you don't get any water up in the handle there. And just all of them down. There we go. And then you just, I give them a little bit of a stir, but that's really me. And then you leave them for about 20 minutes and then we'll rinse them and clean them up. I'll come back to that in 20 minutes time. So about 20 minutes have passed and as you can see the water's already now like really greasy and stuff like that. Uh, the brushes are clean so now it's time to rinse them. So as I'm rinsing them of course need a tap and a sink and then you need a comb. This is a, an old one with some, uh, there's a lot of space in between the tooth so you will need that one too. And then we literally gonna waste some water while we're rinsing them, but there's no way around that, sorry. So let's start by rinsing some brushes here. So we will go and, and rinse all the products out of them. I hold my hand like this and then I just drive them around like this. Sorry for the noise of the tap, but that's the way it is. Press up some of the water, and then I take the comb here, and then I just go through the brushes to uh, make sure I have everything out and there won't be anything left in them, but also to make sure the hairs here ain't sticking together. And then just press up the excess water, and then I'm putting them in a, on a dish cloth here and then just next one again hold your hand and then put some water in it and then just drive the brush around for a bit and then the comb and then make sure the hair's not stick press up the excess water and then just continue until you have no more brushes So, done. 
Um, now all the brushes are clean and as you can see they are now here on the kitchen towel thing beside the sink and I'm just gonna leave them here to dry until tomorrow and then they will be all dry they are also as you can see all totally clean this is my foundation brush all clean all neat and tight and can just dry off so that is how I clean my brushes and I'm doing this like once a week ish if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and please uh, if you like content from me subscribe and click the bell notification icon and uh, then yeah see you next week bye bye